Oh, hey traders, welcome to the video. Please pause the video and make sure you understand the disclaimer before proceeding. We've got the uh, US 100 open on a four hour chart. Let me just quickly go out to the daily and I'll show you what I've marked up here on the charts. There's just a couple of points of interest that we really need to be mindful of if we're looking to trade this. One is this gap. This is the daily. We've got a price gap. If you have a look at this candle here, look left. We're looking for the low of the candle left and the high of the candle right. That is definitely unresolved imbalance. So is this looking to trade back up into this, looking for this balance area up here? Possibly. See this candle? See how it, it wicked back through it? And that's the kind of thing that I'm looking for here. So that's on the daily. We've got this unresolved gap. And if we go down to the four hour chart, and I mean, I'm looking for an opportunity on the lower time frame for a, to get involved here, but you want to kind of know what you've got here. So there's a possibility the market's going to be looking for two things, one liquidity, and the second thing it's looking for imbalances. There's a possibility that that'll get filled. So, you know, is this now we've got this rally. Is this looking to trade north? It's kind of holding up here. So that could be a thing, right? So keep that in mind. The other thing that we have here is on the four hour chart, we've got this candle here. Look left, grab the, the, the high and look right. And we pick up the low imbalance. So my question is, if we look at this from a, a Fibonacci traders perspective, and we pull a fib, kind of makes sense. Is this looking to trade up into here? But do we get what you would expect? A pullback down into the 61.8 to 786 kind of makes sense. This is the weekly open, this orange. And if it does trade back down here, then we, we look to fill this, uh, we trade through this imbalance down into this balance area. I've pulled this from, this is a four hour chart, All right? We go the top of this red candle here okay this candle high and low pull that across does it look to trade back down into here that would make sense to me down into the 61786 fib zone all right so if this is going to look to trade north well that that kind of makes sense doesn't it it doesn't just kind of well it did here <laughs> but yeah it pulls back you know we rally retrace rally retrace so i mean that that makes a lot of sense to me that this pulls back down into this this uh, this range down in here looking looking to rebalance. What else have we got here? We've traded into, look at this, see? Look left, big resistance level through here. I've marked up this orange box. This is a uh, four hour order block. So we've traded right into that, wicked through it. So do we get the pullback I'm down into this, this uh, level down here? Looking for the opportunity to trade this, I have a, a method. I've got my, my way of moving with the momentum in the market. Uh, so let me just show you that. We'll go down to this chart. This is a five minute chart. I've got a, a whole bunch of stuff going on here, but I want to show you this. These dots, I don't touch them when they're on a steep trend, but I do. When it's trending sideways, these dots, what we wait for is the candle next to it. And I'm going to enter anywhere from candle close to the candle wick. All right. I'm looking for the next candle and then I'll take it. All right. We want a couple of candles in a row. And we want this dot to stick. It repaints deliberately. All right. I want this to change with the condition of the, the, the um, price action. But the next candle will, will confirm it. It'll either be there or not be there. And that's that's when we're looking for our opportunity. So, I mean, look at that trade off this dot. All right, we, we've got these alerts set up. Now, we've also got this alert here. There's different rules for trading this. Guys, join my free Discord. The link is below. I there's, Look, it's a, it's a great resource for traders. And, and you're welcome to join at no cost. Jump on board. Click the link and join Discord. Now, this... Uh, this breakout signal here what we're looking for is a retrace back down into see these white bars well what we do is we pull pull this through these white bars that gives us an entry when it trades back down into that so your entry could have been here or here anywhere in this range doesn't matter but there's your trade off that signal it's the same thing with this red one 
All right, we're looking for the white bars left. There it is. I prefer if we get a, a, a pretty recent pullback into it. This time it didn't happen, and you may or may not have taken that trade, but, you know, there, there's a trade. Let me just show you how effective these signals are. All right, again, my rules of engagement, there's a, a, a green break, and I'm looking for the last white bar that I see, and then I'm going to enter long. How do we go with that one? Yeah, well, there you go. So you stop losses under and you stay in it. And as I mentioned, these dots, leave them alone when the market's in a steep trend. But on this five minute, when you see that, I'm looking at the, uh, the candle bodies, as I mentioned. If that next candle uh, paints and that dot is still there, I'm looking for entry. And we've got it right here. It wicked back twice into this level. That's your, that's your buy opportunity, especially when you've got these divergence lines. It's, it's trending sideways. We've got the divergence. We've got the dot. That's your trade. And again, breakout. Where's your white bar left? There. That was your short, however you did that. This one, we yeah, you kind of miss that because we don't have a candle next to it. So we let that one go. I'm looking for the next candle to come back into it. Again, look, guys, jump on board with me. Gain access to the indicators. There's no technical analysis here. This is just trading, and you may have got that one as well, off, off these signals on a five-minute chart. This one here, yeah, I mean, that, that would have been okay. It's not a steep trend. If it's a steep trend, I'll, I'll let it go. Comes back into it. That'll work. This is, this is the one you want. This is it, right? This orange line is a weekly key level of support. You get the divergent signals here, these green, and the dot. Mark up your candle close. That's your trade. And it went on and on and on. That is an ideal setup. This one, a buy, yeah, short-lived. Yeah, that would have been all right. Short-lived, you know, you got a little bit out of it. This is your breakout. We didn't pull back into our white candle range back here. So I would have let that one go. And it depends how, you, how well you read price action. Uh, you know, it kind of got away. So I wouldn't chase that. Let it go. There's plenty of opportunities. I mean, this will work on any currency pair, any instrument. Here, depending on your stop loss, of course. This is trading down into res uh, support. Right? Depending on where your stop loss is. Anyway, uh, the link is below, guys. Gain access to the indicators, my whole system. I've got educational tutorials, everything. So with that, that's my take on the on the US 100. Oh, coming back to the current. Well, I'm just waiting for a signal in whichever direction it decides. I would prefer to short this at this point. I think we've got a uh, we've got a weekly up here. That's a weekly. So if this trades up, it gives me a dot, or if it rolls over and it gives me a um, a red uh, triangle. That could be the thing, waiting for the setup. All right, guys, with that, I hope you have a great day. Safe trading, and I look forward to seeing you in Discord.